What can you do with one million cups of coffee? Have a million conversations that can potentially generate millions of ideas. And today, Iowa's Lieutenant Governor came to Cedar Rapids to have one of those conversations. We know in order to grow our economy, it's going to be startups and existing businesses, small businesses growing and expanding here in the state of Iowa. And Kim Reynolds wants to help shine a light on what the Corridor's entrepreneurial community is doing. That's why she attended this event called One Million Cups. We adopted the program back in March. We're the sixth uh, city in the nation to do so. During this weekly gathering over coffee, local startups pitch their businesses to a diverse audience of mentors, advisors, and other entrepreneurs. And it really gives them an opportunity to connect, develop those relationships that they may not have anywhere else. We work on every single type of scooter. Today's presentation featured Moped U, the first and only full-service moped sales and rental shop in the corridor. And Next Step IO, an evolving startup that's getting major help from Nike to focus on personal activity trackers. You know, we get so kind of down in the weeds a lot, we need to be brought back up and pitch a lot. And that pitching also helps educate other people about what we're doing. Rotating each week between Iowa City and Cedar Rapids, today's setting was the Old World Theater to allow Reynolds' participation in a town hall. So we want to do everything that we can to encourage, support that, and really help provide the network and the momentum that we see going on all across the state of Iowa. And when you ask a business owner what else the government can do? Just don't put rocks on the racetrack. So that's one thing they can do is, like, don't, don't slow us down. To reach more people, One Million Cups will soon stream its 9 a.m. meetings live on the Internet, thanks to the new Iowa Startup Accelerator. It's another way the corridor is fostering innovation.